Okay, folks, it's now um, 8.39 a.m., April 22nd. If you take a minute to go back and um, look at the videos that I made an hour ago, um, you'll notice that all the blue in the sky is gone, and it's socked in with clouds over there where they were laying out all those heavy lines. It's still really gray, um, if I'm pointing to the east. There's barely any blue in the sky. There's a little bit um, above, directly above, and then um, pointing to the west. Jet, but then you also see it immediately disappear. It doesn't, um, it doesn't stay and leave a long line that expands into a cloud. So that's a contrail. Um, like I said, you know, it looks slightly blue, but if you go back and compare it to an hour ago, You'll see that um, there's um, not blue, <laughs> not compared to what it was an hour ago. And even an hour ago, there was still a lot of um, haze in the sky. But um, sometimes on these warmer days, and today we were set for 70 degree temperatures, I, c I like to be optimistic and hope for the best that the um, sun will prevent the um, clouds from being able to build up. sure if the camera is going to pick it up, but um, you can see there's still crisscrossing patterns above us, so it's probably going to stick. It's just really unfortunate. And I can, um, in the clouds that are surrounding the sun, I can see the um, rainbow spectrum, that ring. That ring is there, so we'll see if the um, camera is able to pick it up. I noticed that on the um, last video from 7.39 or 7.32 a.m. this morning, that it was able to pick up that uh, color spectrum. It's just really sad that this is um, happening in our community, and, and we hear very few people willing to discuss it. But everybody, you know, most people who look up see it. Good for today, folks.